Hi everybody, Belover911 here with my tutorial for RPG Maker XP. So I've been going over event commands and I came to labels and jump to label. I had no idea what they were for. So I went online and searched and searched for what these actually did. And let me say, I could have used these a lot. So I'm glad I know these now, but I wish I had known this before. So what it does is it sets a waypoint in your event command that you can go back to. I'll give you an example. Let's have our friend Bob here say, what do you want? And we'll have our choices say, Um, we'll have him say, hi, nothing, and what? So, we'll have him say hi to us, give, him an, give us a little welcoming before this. So, when we say hi to him, he'll say hi back to us. When we say nothing, we'll do exit event processing. And when he says what, we'll go jump to label 1. So label 1 will have, at the very beginning, label, name it 1. So I'll show you what this does and then explain it. Talk to him. He says, hi, what do you want? Say hi to him, he'll say hi back. Hi, what do you want? Nothing. And he stops talking. Hi, what do you want? You say what? He says, hi, what do you want? So, now the explanation. So in this conditional branch, or rather this choice branch, when you say what to him, it jumps to label 1. Label 1 is at the very beginning, so it starts all over again. So, yeah, that's pretty much self-explanatory. This is very useful. I could have used this a lot in my events for my games. And now you know. Join me in my other tutorials. I'll see you then.